guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here i'm brie renee straight from the a baby don't forget to like comment and subscribe and if you aren't new here welcome back welcome back welcome back and if you aren't new here you already know that i am in new orleans baby that's right so i came to new orleans to um be with Lowe's because he's filming a show down here and um, he actually has to film today so I was like let me just come get something to eat because people was walking by I'd be so weird talking to the camera when people walk by anyway so yeah so I'm down here in New Orleans Lowe's is filming the show we spent most of yesterday well we spent all of yesterday together but I couldn't really take y'all with me because I was on camera and I was filming as well so you'll see me in this new season of College Hill. Um, that's what he's doing. He's going to the prestigious University of Xavier or Xavier University down here in New Orleans. And um, yes, yeah, so I came to visit him. See, I got on his Letterman today. But yeah, so he's filming right now and I couldn't be like in these scenes because it don't got nothing to do with me. It's like not your show. He stayed the night with me at the hotel, but then I just dropped him off at the room. I mean, I just dropped him back off at the house and he's got a little, little filming obligations to do for a couple hours and then he's off the rest of the afternoon. But I was like, let me just find a cute little cafe, get some breakfast, maybe watch church online and get some work done on my iPad. I should have brought my whole laptop with me. Um, it's in the room, but I could probably just, I'm not far, so I can just, after I get breakfast and stuff, I can go back and do that. But I'm just gonna get some work done. I just wanted to bring you guys along. I'm looking so cute in my man. Letterman and just like, and I got on this hoodie and some jeans. Um, but why is New Orleans this cold in February? Like, I don't ever remember New Orleans being 40 degrees. And I did not pack properly because when I checked Alexa before I left the house, they said it was going to be 65, 70. So I didn't bring the right clothes. Luckily, I had a hoodie and then Los has this Letterman that I'm wearing. So we're going to make it work. But yeah, I leave in the morning. So hopefully we can make the most out of today. So yeah, let's just go get some food. I'm starving and I want some coffee. First of all, I haven't, I haven't gotten the food yet, but I do want to say I appreciate the pricing. I got a granola bowl, a croissant sandwich with ham, egg, and cheese, as well as an iced coffee for $24. And that included the tip. That's the responsible pricing, and I'm really rocking that. So I just want to give y'all a review before I get the food, so I think it'll be good. channel well i think i already welcomed you back to the channel either way though it's been a time okay it's been a lot going on let me fill you in got to new orleans um definitely was on camera the whole time could not vlog the entire time we had a good time it was so good to see him i i got to meet everybody in the house i got to you know see his room see the house see like how everything was going see some of his work get his grades his midterm grades came back he was doing really good but you got to watch the show to see what was going on um i'm really proud of him and yeah, it was a good, fun experience. It was very short. I did miss him. I was so sad I had to leave. We went out to eat. He did get to stay with me at the hotel both nights I was there. But we went out to eat, what was that, Sunday night? Because I flew back Monday. Went out to eat Sunday. I have never in my life had bad food from New Orleans, child. 
But the food that we had, his food was good. My food was not. It was like a seafood kind of gumbo type of thing. And it had oysters in it. And the oysters tasted weird to me when I was eating them. So I kind of like stopped eating my plate because I felt like, oh, this tastes funny. And good thing I did because my flight left at like 5.30 a.m. So I had to wake up at like 2 something to take him to the hotel, take him back to the house and like, you know, get to the airport and everything. Why did I wake up at 2 something throwing up? profusely like i was sick as hell so had to get on the flight sick as fuck made it to the airport everything did everything i had to do i was rushing to get to that flight but i made it on time first class mommy i love that they flew me out first class shout out to bet for that yeah once i got home as soon as i landed i had to go straight to film to, to the studio to film trap news left trap news i had to come home pick up trish's birthday gift because it was his birthday party Went to Trish's birthday party because they was out of school this week for some reason. So my sister had the birthday party at like 3 o'clock. Made it to the birthday party. After that, I started to crash because I was so tired. I was so exhausted from being up all night and being sick. So I made it back home at like 6 something. Um, took a nap. I had to get up and go to Ernestine House at 8 something to film auditions that were due on Tuesday. Got both of those auditions in Monday night. So Monday was jam-packed. Tuesday, I had to go back to 85 Style Studios to help Moneybag with an audition, fill up the vending machine, go to the post office to mail orders, and just handle a bunch of admin work for myself, my mom, and Carlos. When I tell you I have been busy, 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 overwhelmed, and overworked, but it's okay because I'm trying to get so much done because we're about to go film Scheme Queens in the Virgin Islands, Scheme Queens 2. I'm about to go film Skin Queens 2 in the Virgin Islands. So I'm going to be gone for two weeks. So I have to get as much as I can done now before I leave. Because when I'm gone, I'm going to be filming. And I don't know how much work I'm going to be able to get done out there. Of course, I'm going to take y'all with me. So y'all going to get the vlog experience. But I don't think I'm going to get much work work done. But anyway, so that's where I've been at. Today is Wednesday. And, um, I got up, I've been kind of cleaning up the living room because again, I came home and just like was on go. So the house was looking crazy. I'm doing laundry. Polka is coming. Today is actually Ernestine's birthday. So me and Chi Chi are going to surprise her at her acting class tonight and like go to acting class, but we're going to bring balloons and cupcakes and just make it a whole thing. Um, cause she, her class is actually on her birthday, so she can't do anything outside of that. But yeah, so we're going to go do that. And then polka, that's at seven. Polka lands at nine. So I, thankfully the legacy center is by the airport. I'm going to pick polka up from the airport at nine. And then me and polka are going to get our eyebrows done and then go get something to eat. And then we'll come home tomorrow. I'm getting my hair done. I have to get my hair rebraided because it has to be braided for the film. I'm just getting those same knotless braids that I had that I love back in. So I have to wash my hair tonight when we come home. I'm kind of sad because this blowout was still blowing out. You know what I'm saying? It was still cute. But I got to get it done because I won't have time to get it done next week. Because next week, I got to go back to New Orleans for Carlos's graduation. Why am I whispering? He's not hearing me. I'm planning him a surprise graduation party. So I'm trying to figure all that stuff out as well. Because I have to go down there Tuesday through Thursday and next week for the graduation. It's just a lot going on. A lot of moving pieces. A lot of moving parts. And like I said, again, my brain is feeling like spaghetti. And I'm just trying to do everything and make sure I got everything handled for everybody before I leave. So, yeah. That's T really. So I'm cleaning up right now because Tristan came over here and he pissed all over my guest bathroom. Like it's pee all over the toilet. It's pee all over the flow. It's just piss. So it's marinating in cleaning products right now. Like you know how to spray it down with all the, the cleaning products and got the Ajax sitting on it. You know how you marinate the toilet before you clean it? It's marinating right now. So I just wanted to hop on here and tell y'all that I'm about to put on some music and get to cleaning so and i my memory card is almost full clearly 
So I can't let y'all, I can't take y'all with me cleaning because I want to take y'all with me later. But that's why I've been in. That's what's going on. I'm sorry. I, I, I need to stop apologizing because y'all my cousins. Y'all know. Life be life in, okay? And yeah, that's that's where we at this week. Wednesday, February 21st, we going to get this shit done. And I could do it, right? I could do it. I could do it. You could do it. All right, I love y'all. I'll see y'all in a few once I get ready to go pick up the balloons. Hey, guys. So, I am at the Party City. First of all, my hair is long and flourishing. And I think this is such a cute style. I got a claw clip half up, half down with my real hair two pieces in the front. But it's like, yes, we need to wear this more often because this is cute. Too bad I'm getting my hair braided tomorrow. But anyways, I'm pulling up at Party City. I, ordered, I, don't, I hope I didn't go OD. But I'm going to get the balloons, a car. I need a gift bag. Cause I got her some sunglasses and um a birthday card. I need a birthday card, a gift bag, and some confetti. Like, Bruh, happy birthday! And guess what? I'm throwing that shit, but I'm not trying to clean that shit up. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah. Look, y'all. Chi Chi got the cupcakes. And the cake. We about to surprise her. The door is locked. The door is locked. The balloons, the balloons is are popped. popping. Oh my god. Okay. Oh my I thought god. I just assumed somebody would be there. Dang. Was there some kind of? Oh, oh my, my god. god. Just... <laughs> we did not prepare. I ain't got no choice but to ring the door. It's no way. She gonna send somebody else out. <laughs> she see us. Surprise! Surprise, friend! Happy birthday! Sorry to interrupt y'all class. Thank you. Oh my gosh! Thank you guys. Oh, thank you. I'm sorry, Queen. Happy birthday! Put my card. Oh, the cake is so cute. That is so cute. Yay, happy birthday. The confetti. <laughs> happy birthday, friend. Bearing gifts for my birthday. Yes. Thank you. We got a light the candles. Like the candles. Yeah. I'm going to tell y'all grown ass is going to have no cake in a minute. No, 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 no. nobody named Chelsea and I keep calling Shelby Chelsea and it's not like a new homegirl it's my homegirl that I've known my whole I've never done that though I don't know why it's okay Chelsea just it's not the first time that it's happened in the past two days so maybe you have a doppelganger 
that's named Chelsea. What is that? A doppelganger is like somebody on the other side of the world or somewhere that you don't know. Someone that you don't know that looks just like you. And we call it a what? A doppelganger. A doppelganger. Like, you know how they be like, your celebrity lookalike. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a doppelganger. Okay. Yeah. I gotta add that to my vocabulary. Maybe you have a doppelganger named Chelsea. Maybe. I would agree. Mm-hmm. But anyways, I'm getting my bracelet back in, you know. And we actually moving fast. Really Our fast. Products, we might actually be done by the time your client get here. I wouldn't doubt it, because she's coming at 11.30. It's on now. And I'm Period. working halfway through your head. Period. In an hour. Yeah. Come on. We, we found our technique for this hairstyle. Mm -hmm. So I think we're moving and grooving now. I'm excited to get them back. They're going to look how they gonna look how I'm looking now, like, fresh the first time because we know what we're doing. Yeah, we know what we're doing. We got a technique. We and know what you didn't blow works. dry it out. Yeah, like, blow drying it is what throws it off. We can't blow dry it. Yeah, it's because it don't need to be straight. Yeah, it doesn't need to be straight. It throws off everything. Yeah. So, period. We're going to come back. Okay. We'll be back. Okay guys, look at the finished product. You know, my my girl Shelby back there. Wait, they can't see you. Wait, let me. Okay, you guys, you already know. Book with her. I'm gonna put her booking on her Instagram below. But yeah, she did her thug this and it didn't even take half the time it took last time. And you see she did the baby hair is they on. You know, this is my Detroit Diva. Okay. And we, the older it get, you already know, the flyer it be, so period. Y'all, these came out even cuter than last time. Okay, period. Yes. And then, you know, the older they get, the even more, like, full the pieces be. And it just be everything. I love it. Period. Got my little protective style back. And this is what um, my hair going to be like in the movie. So, they don't got to do my hair that much on set. I hate being in hair and makeup. Y'all know that. But, anyways. Okay, I'm about to go shoot, shoot some skits for um, some skits with Ernestine. I'm part of her storyline on the Country Wayne Facebook page. So, if y'all are part of that group, go look at it. Um, yeah, I'm going to be in her storyline coming in. Oh, yeah, I'm about to go shoot with them. First, I need something to eat. What time is it? My call time not till 1. And that's right at 12, 15. I got time to grab something real quick and head that way. All right, TTYL. All right, y'all. This is my homegirl, Jamira. Hello. Okay, we did just finish. I didn't show y'all none of the Country Wayne skits because it went so fast. But then Poco called me. And um, Zoe and Jamira was already at Bar Taco. So Margaritas we, and tacos. We just pulled up. Can't say no to that. You sure can't. You, they tempted me. Yeah. When she said on the phone, I was like, no, nah, I'm going to go home. She was like, no, nah, I got you a margarita way as soon as you come it was to the door. I said, oh, I'm on the way. <laughs> okay. So we just pulled up. I don't know. You, no, you guys haven't met her before because I haven't seen Never. Jamira in a month of Sunday. 50 Jamira. years, but we locked in from way back in the day. A long day. time, then. We kind of remember just almost 10 years now. Yeah. Jamira, tell them where they can follow you and what you do. At Jamira Love, J-A-M-M-Y-R-A-L-O-V-E. And I am a creative director and I own a production company. Because so, I hang with bosses around here. Okay, and then y'all already know. Y'all already know Zoe and Hope. Hey, hey guys. Did you miss you? They eating. Probably miss you. They did like y'all. They did say, oh, okay, we got some other cousins. <laughs> hey, cousins. No. She's a butt smacker and I hate it. I'm a butt smacker. None of your butters say. None of your butters say. <laughs> well, yeah, we're here at Bar Taco getting some good little oh. snack. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, catch you with your side, bitch. No, I'm just playing. So, yeah, um. Oh, this is the lighting right here. So yeah, I just came here to get, I just literally had one margarita and some guacamole. And I'm sleepy. I'm ready to go home. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Let's go. You think you cute because you got your hair did, you mean? I did get my hair did today, you guys. So good. It's almost back to like where it was. You know when it get old, it get real good. And I got to put some product in it. We don't got no real product in the hair, for real. I found my mama in your shit. And I hate that. I should have hid my products because Indeed. natural hair bitches be all in your shit. I all up in her shit. I used her it because I had a carry-on bag and I couldn't bring my own. 
Well, it's okay. It pays to have good friends. Andrew. Andrew. Yo, I need a nap, yo, because me and Poker was up to like three, three in the morning talking on the phone to Tierra. That's why I'm sleepy. But it was a, it was worth it. Yeah, and I had to be up at six. I'm not that was a really good conversation. It really was. I got this. We talked book, about like this new book. I gotta show y'all. We talked about breaking generational curses. Ooh, Dang, dang. mama. We talked about generational curses. We talked about trauma. We talked about everything. We did healing. Right. No, we did talk about. We talked about how when you heal yourself, you're healing not only for your children but also for your past generations because your parents didn't have the luxury to heal themselves. <laughs> I'm, I'm so fucking because Poker wanted to be in a video so bad, but she did not want me to eat the rest of the night. I'm going to turn around. <laughs> yeah, she's trying to eat and be greedy and be in the camera. Y'all know Poker is a celebrity esthetician, so she was down here doing her celebrity clients. I just don't understand how I didn't get done because I'm her number one celebrity because you client. My boo, and I had to see you first. She's going to squeeze me in on the back end. Just, I bought you some products, though. Period. Okay. Well, we'll, we'll take that. We'll take it. So and, I'll yeah. be back, and I'll be back in two weeks. Follow Po. I won't be here. You won't be here? When? No. Look, I'm still saying I'm it's your house. <laughs> I'm going to the Virgin Island to film Skin Queen. All right, y'all. We're going to make the, uh, a vlog crash in Brie House. No the fuck we don't. Because <laughs> they don't know I can change the code for my phone. No. So they won't be able to get in. <laughs> I would be driving around like, maybe one way in there and you're going. No, the fuck she won't. <laughs> yo, I'm going to pick up her extra camera and be like, hey, yo, it's your country cousin. Look, look, look. I'm a YouTuber. Look. Get us to a thousand likes and we're going to crash a breeze. A thousand likes. Yeah. Get a thousand likes on this video. Subscribe, hit the notification bell, and we gonna crash B House. Watch, not B House. Vlog it. We gonna crash B House and vlog it. Watch it out of town, and then we gonna send it to her so she can upload it to the channel. If they crash my house, y'all, for y'all, only if they did it. I, I only if y'all give me a thousand likes. <laughs> like, well, if y'all go subscribe, they might as well go ahead. I would and say, <laughs> that's how much I love them. I'm like, only if it's for y'all, but I would not. Don't do that. Let's, don't even like. I mean, but we like it. We, and I clean like, up after you. In my house. I'm a good, I'm a good guest. She do, she do, she I do. I clean up. She like, damn, Pope. I'm like, yeah. Aye. Look, look, aye, look. Don't act, leave it extra for me, though. No, I don't want it to be a dog. <laughs> no, I'm just saying. I don't want him to crash it. I don't want to crash it. Y'all, because I'm kind of like. Look, I don't want him to crash it. Unless you give me a dog. Right. 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 <laughs> No real talk, cause I am kind of like a only. I got a sibling, but I'm kind of like an only child. Yeah, so it's had, like, yeah. oh, you in my space without me she, being in my space yeah. to regulate it. Yeah, she uh, got only child syndrome. Yeah, she do. That really that makes my flesh call thinking about it. <laughs> oh. And meanwhile, I'm gonna be Dave Chappelle in that bitch. Fuck your couch. <laughs> I'm gonna be pissed. Okay, <laughs> jokes <laughs> over. <laughs> Ew, she said she gonna fart inside my pillowcase. <laughs> Oh, that ass got clap back on it. Oh, my battery about to die. I gotta go, guys. See you in a minute.